So hello guys, I made this video to explain how to solve this issue with with the the, the situation when you get hacked your wallet and some script that it's forwarding all the amount of BNB that you transfer to your wallet account to these kind of accounts that only receive BNB. You can check it here. So uh, I was reading and we can actually uh, transfer tokens excluding BNB to our account or to our new account. So first I gonna to tell you is that you can actually recover your account. The best you can the best thing you can do is to create a new account and use that one and try to hide the, the, the best you can your your seed phrase and try to be careful and all of that stuff that you already know. So to explain what we are going to do here is basically allow a function that is already in our metamask you don't need to install anything uh this is to show you how i transfer some mm, wait uh, let me check here i transferred yesterday some amount of of tokens mm, wait here is the wallet so Here you can check how I, I made this trick, uh, overloading basically the, the transaction queue to my hacked wallet from my new wallet to my uh, my new wallet that is here right now. So I just overload the transaction queue to my hacked wallet. So uh, this allow us to have a, a time window frame to, to send our tokens only tokens you can send actually BNB is really, really, really hard to make that because when you transfer the, the script that uh, is working, I don't know how it works, uh, just uh, increase the amount of gas so the transactions are being or forwarded to the hacked amount really fast. This amount is really fast. So uh, let's start explaining that this is the hacked amount. This is my, my amount of CPAN. I just made this video to show you guys. Uh, you need to allow this, this fusion. First, you're going to do is to go to your account configuration. Then you go to advanced configuration. And below this info uh, or down this info, you are going to, to see this. Uh, in English, I think it's something about the nouns transaction to allow or configure as no transaction before send. So this allows you to prepare the contracts without sending it actually. So you can make a lot of transactions without the approval. And the things here is to prepare around 20 or 15. I don't know. Uh, I always or usually prepare around 15, 20. This time I'm preparing 20 to see if we can actually uh, withdraw well our our amount of CPAN in the other account. So here you can check the nouns amount. So the nouns organize the, the number of transactions and the your your hacked wallet only can receive one by one by one by one by one. So this is basically what we are going to do. You can check here how I, I have been preparing the transactions reducing the number until the current one. So my current transaction number is also uh, another thing is that I'm sending the minimum minimum amount to to be able to to only spend the minimum money possible to recover this kind of of, of token because right now 20 C pen is right ten dollars. So uh this kind of amount is really minimum, so you can prepare a lot of transactions with this minimum because I can assure you that you will be able to send your money. And then when you accept, you will receive this kind of number, uh, uh, the, the nouns. This is a new option that you will have uh, in your MetaMask. So the last I sent was 102, so 101. You confirm and then you can check that actually it gets in a queue waiting for the curing and transaction in order to send uh, all the transactions together and also 
I have already saved my new account in my Hacker account. So here is the last one, I think. Sorry. Yes, here's, this is the last one. So you need to be very fast to, to send or, or forward these kind of tokens to your new account. So when you send, you are going to see how all the transactions are going to arrive to your new account. So you will be able to, to forward in very short amount of time, like here, for example. So you need to be very fast. And that's it. Basically, you send uh, the money because it's really impossible for the script to, uh, to, to receive all the transactions together. And, and here, you will receive all your money. And actually, I can uh, continue to do this with, for example, this short amount of money that I have here. Because it's really rather hard uh, for the script to to receive all these kind of transactions. See, he's forwarding, but also he's receiving uh, the twenty transactions that I already made. And for example, if I want to check my my account in BCC scan. We can check here. Uh, you can check also a lot of fake tokens that these people get in your account to make this happen. So that's it. I uh, hope you guys do enjoy it uh, and like the video.